The Carnivore's Conundrum Is this diet a roaring good time or a recipe for disaster? Is the carnivore diet right for everyone or could it be harmful to some? This is a question that has sparked heated debates among nutritionists, dietitians, and health enthusiasts alike. That's the million-dollar question or perhaps the million-burger question in this case. The carnivore diet with its audacious all-meat mantra has taken the wellness world by storm. The carnivore diet with its audacious all-meat mantra has taken the wellness world by storm, sparking curiosity and controversy in equal measure. Advocates claim it can lead to weight loss, improved mental clarity, and even relief from chronic illnesses, sparking curiosity and controversy in equal measure. Critics, however, warn of potential nutritional deficiencies and long-term health risks. But is this radical approach to eating a sustainable path to health or is it a risky gamble with your well-being? The carnivore diet eliminates all plant-based foods, focusing solely on animal products. Imagine a world where your plate overflows with juicy steaks, sizzling bacon and succulent chicken while fruits, vegetables and grains cower in the shadows. This, my friends, is the carnivorous landscape, while fruits, vegetables and grains cower in the shadows. This diet is not just about eating meat, it's about rejecting the foods that have been staples in human diets for centuries. This, my friends, is the carnivorous landscape, a realm where meat reigns supreme and plant-based foods are banished to the outer realms of dietary heresy. But what does science say about this extreme way of eating? But before you don your best Fred Flintstone attire and charge headfirst into this meat-centric universe, let's pause for a moment of carnivorous contemplation. It's essential to weigh the pros and cons before making such a drastic dietary shift. Let's pause for a moment of carnivorous contemplation. While the allure of an all-meat diet might seem tempting, it's crucial to remember that our bodies are complex ecosystems, finely tuned over millennia to thrive on a diverse range of nutrients. While the allure of an all-meat diet might seem tempting, it's crucial to remember that our bodies are complex ecosystems, finely tuned over millennia to thrive on a diverse range of nutrients. A diet devoid of fruits, vegetables, and grains could lead to deficiencies in essential vitamins and minerals, finely tuned over millennia to thrive on a diverse range of nutrients. Our ancestors consumed a variety of foods and this diversity played a crucial role in our evolution and overall health. So, buckle up, meat-loving mavericks and curious carnivores, as we embark on a thrilling expedition into the heart of the carnivore diet, exploring its potential benefits and pitfalls. We'll delve into the science behind this diet, hear from experts, and share real-life experiences from those who have embraced this meat-heavy lifestyle. As we embark on a thrilling expedition into the heart of the carnivore diet, exploring its potential benefits and pitfalls, and uncovering whether this meat-heavy approach is a prescription for optimal health or a recipe for dietary disaster. We'll also look at the psychological and social aspects of following such a restrictive diet, exploring its potential benefits and pitfalls, and uncovering whether this meat-heavy approach is a prescription for optimal health or a recipe for dietary disaster. Stay tuned as we dissect the carnivore diet piece by piece to help you make an informed decision about whether this diet is right for you, and uncovering whether this meat-heavy approach is a prescription for optimal health or a recipe for dietary disaster. Join us on this journey to understand the full spectrum of the carnivore diet, from its historical roots to its modern-day implications. Meat and Greet What exactly is the carnivore diet? The carnivore diet, in all its meaty glory, is about as straightforward as a diet can get. It's a dietary regimen that revolves entirely around animal products, primarily meat. Imagine a plate piled high with various meats, beef, chicken, pork, fish seasoned with a dash of salt and pepper. This is the essence of the carnivore diet where meat is not just the main course but the only course. Now eliminate everything else. No fruits, no vegetables, no grains, no dairy. This means saying goodbye to your morning smoothie, your lunchtime salad, and even your evening bowl of ice cream. You're left with the bare bones, or rather the fleshy muscle, of the carnivore diet. It's a minimalist approach to eating that focuses solely on animal-based foods. Picture a world where breakfast means a hefty serving of bacon and eggs, cooked to perfection and served without any toast or fruit on the side. For lunch, you might enjoy a juicy burger, but hold the bun and veggies, it's just the meat patty, perhaps with a slice of cheese if you're not strictly avoiding dairy. And dinner? A tender steak, grilled to your liking, becomes the star of the show. No side dishes, no garnishes, just pure, unadulterated meat. When it comes to snacks, think beef jerky, bone broth, or perhaps a few slices of cold cuts. These are the go-to options for those following the carnivore diet. Proponents of this meat-centric approach claim a wide array of benefits, from weight loss and increased energy to improved digestion and reduced inflammation. They argue that by eliminating plant-based foods you can avoid many of the common allergens and irritants found in a typical diet. They argue that our ancestors who thrived on a hunter-gatherer diet rich in animal products provide the evolutionary blueprint for this way of eating. 
The idea is that our bodies are naturally adapted to a diet that is heavy on meat and light on plant-based foods. However, before you swap your salad for a sirloin, it's crucial to remember that the carnivore diet is an extreme approach with potential risks. While it may offer short-term benefits, the long-term health implications are still a subject of debate among nutrition experts. Eliminating entire food groups can lead to nutrient deficiencies, and the long-term effects of such a restrictive diet are still largely unknown. It's important to consult with a healthcare professional before making any drastic changes to your diet, especially one as radical as the carnivore diet. In conclusion, while the carnivore diet may appeal to those looking for a simple, meat-focused eating plan, it's essential to weigh the potential benefits against the risks. A balanced diet that includes a variety of food groups is generally recommended for overall health and well-being. Red Alert! Cardiovascular Risks and the Carnivore Diet Hold on to your hats, carnivorous comrades, because we're about to delve into the heart of the matter, literally. The carnivore diet, which consists solely of animal products, has been gaining popularity for its promise of weight loss and improved health. But what about its impact on your heart? When it comes to the carnivore diet and cardiovascular health, things can get a little dicey. While some people report feeling better and losing weight, the long-term effects on heart health are still a major concern. Imagine your arteries as a network of highways, responsible for transporting vital nutrients and oxygen throughout your body. These highways need to be clear and unobstructed to function properly. Now, picture those highways being clogged with a steady stream of saturated fat and cholesterol, courtesy of your all-meat diet. This can lead to a buildup of plaque, which narrows the arteries and restricts blood flow. Not exactly a recipe for smooth sailing, is it? This blockage can cause a traffic jam in your arteries, leading to serious health issues. Studies have shown that diets high in saturated fat, a staple of the carnivore diet, can raise LDL cholesterol levels, often referred to as the bad cholesterol. High LDL levels are a known risk factor for heart disease. This buildup of LDL cholesterol can create plaque deposits in your arteries, narrowing them and increasing your risk of heart disease, stroke, and other cardiovascular complications. It's like adding layers of concrete to your highways, making it harder for traffic to move smoothly. Think of it like this. Every juicy steak or sizzling strip of bacon, while undeniably delicious, could be contributing to the construction of a cholesterol castle in your arteries. Each bite adds another brick to the wall. And trust me, you don't want to be the king or queen of that castle. The consequences can be dire, leading to chest pain, heart attacks, and even death. While some proponents of the carnivore diet argue that its emphasis on lean meats, such as chicken and fish, can reduce these risks, and the elimination of processed foods can mitigate these risks, it's important to remember that not all meats are created equal. Lean meats may be lower in saturated fat, but they still contain cholesterol. The scientific evidence remains inconclusive. While some studies suggest that a diet high in animal products can be harmful, Others indicate that it may not be as bad as we think. More research is needed to fully understand the long-term effects of the carnivore diet on cardiovascular health. In the meantime, it's crucial to consult with a healthcare professional before making any drastic changes to your diet. A balanced approach, incorporating a variety of foods, is often the best way to ensure overall health and well-being. Remember, your heart is the engine that keeps you going. Treat it with the care and respect it deserves by making informed dietary choices. Stay healthy, stay informed, and keep those arteries clear. Sweet Danger Navigating Diabetes on the Carnivore Diet For those with diabetes, the carnivore diet presents a particularly treacherous path, fraught with potential pitfalls and unforeseen consequences. Imagine trying to manage your blood sugar levels while subsisting solely on meat. A dietary tightrope walk if there ever was one. The carnivore diet's complete elimination of carbohydrates, including fruits, vegetables, and grains, can send your blood sugar on a roller coaster ride with unpredictable highs and lows. While some individuals with type 2 diabetes may experience initial improvements in blood sugar control due to the drastic reduction in carbs, these benefits are often short lived and can come at a steep price. Think of it like this carbohydrates are like the fuel that keeps your body's engine running smoothly. Eliminating them entirely is like trying to power a car on fumes. You might get a short burst of energy but you're bound to sputter out eventually. Moreover, the carnivore diet's heavy reliance on animal products, often high in saturated fat, can exacerbate insulin resistance, a hallmark of type 2 diabetes. This means your body becomes less efficient at using insulin, the hormone that regulates blood sugar, leading to further complications. Kidney Concerns Can an all-meat diet strain your filters? Our kidneys, those unassuming bean-shaped organs, work tirelessly behind the scenes, filtering waste products from our blood and keeping our internal environment in tip-top shape. 
But can an all-meat diet with its protein-packed punch put undue stress on these vital filters? Imagine your kidneys as a delicate ecosystem, carefully balancing the intake and excretion of various nutrients. Now picture a deluge of protein, courtesy of your carnivorous culinary adventures, flooding this intricate system. While protein is essential for building and repairing tissues, excessive amounts can strain the kidneys, forcing them to work overtime to process the increased waste products. Over time, this constant strain can lead to kidney damage, particularly in individuals with pre-existing kidney conditions. Think of it like this, your kidneys are like a dedicated team of garbage collectors, diligently sorting and disposing of your body's waste. An all-meat diet is like throwing a never-ending supply of trash at them, eventually they're bound to get overwhelmed.